Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's Sydney Marie here. Hi, how you doing? So in today's video, by the time you guys can tell that I'm gonna be doing a how I style my Jordan ones. Um, I'm back to doing a little bit more, you know, fashion content. I've been real stressed lately and um, you know, I wanted to get this video out. I've been wanting to get this video out. Like I have a couple other look type content that I wanna film or fashion content, but you know, getting it done slowly. By all means, I'm not a sneakerhead. Like, I have three pairs of ones, and then I have some other staple shoes that I like to have in my collection. But obviously, this is a style in the ones video. I get all my ones from Go. This is probably one of my most like requested questions. Is where I get my shoes from, and you can assume from Go. Like, if I don't say anywhere else, it's gonna be Go. Love the authentication process with Go. Like, everything about Go is just. I feel except for the prices is a little bit expensive but before we even get started with this video there is a few things that I want to touch just to you know let it be known first of all we hit 15k which is crazy I really didn't get to mention it and um, I've been wanting to mention it I just mentioned it today actually and only reason that I had it is because I've been real real stressed with school and really busy literally this morning I took my midterm and I took another exam I've been doing quizzes projects I have a report due next week like literally being a full-time student trying to be full-time in YouTube and then also having a part-time job is like things get a little bit crazy if I'm ever off or if I ever like don't upload my two uploads a week just know that's the reason why for the most part I'll try to get at least one video up if I can but two is the goal but you know one is making it <laughs> that is that you know um I want to go ahead and jump right in like I said I have three pairs before I even get started with the lookbook I do want to show y'all the pairs I have uh, so this first pair is actually something that I just got recently. I haven't worn them out yet, but I have styled them a couple times. You might have seen them like thrown in a few videos, but they are the, um, what are these? Blue Chill ones. Yeah, that's what they're called. It's a really nice shoe. Um, it's patent leather, of course. These are kind of like the Obsidian ones, but of course they have a patent leather. It's shiny, and I actually debated in between getting the Obsidian ones and then these patent leather ones. I love this colorway, and I love that shininess. I just think it's a really sleek shoe, so, you know, I had to pick this up. And I'm going to try to put the prices of what I spent on this shoe because I know some people ask. And Goat is really, really cool because you can literally catch shoes used. I think the only shoes that I didn't buy used were my Shatter Backwear ones. But these ones and then my Pine Green ones, which are the next pair, I bought them used. And they were probably like maybe $100 less or maybe $50 less. Like you can literally get amazing deals like that. And of course, these would have been cheaper if I bought them like retail like what they came out as but of course i always catch it late for some apparent reason so it's the next sneakers pine green ones these are also used but they are really really nice you guys so i absolutely love these it's just a super sleek shoe this is something i've been wanting in my collection forever like and there's so many different ways you can style them so i'm obsessed i'm obsessed it also comes with red laces which i'm gonna be showing y'all like I don't feel like unlacing it, so that's another reason why I have it on. But the red lace colorway, it just makes that green pop. It's amazing. And then, of course, the last pair are these Shadow Backboard ones. I got these for my birthday fit, but of course, my birthday got canceled because Corona and I couldn't do anything. But I also have these where one of the laces is a different color, so I have one black and one orange. I'll show you the orange ones, but it's just a very shiny shoe. Kind of reminds you of the. Um, blue show ones but these are obviously like it's a little bit more worn like that feel i don't know what that's called like i said i'm not a sneaker head so don't go on me i'm not a sneaker head but yes this is the shoe very nice i love that like off it's not even white it's like a cream beige part of the shoe like that's amazing that's amazing and of course i think i wore these out once <laughs> and i got them in april or like May, march i got them like march april and i only wore them once but look i have had places to go so you know Slowly, slowly but surely. But of course, I got some fits to wear with them. We're gonna go ahead and jump right into this video because, of course, y'all want to see me styling them. It's gonna be lookbook style, so I'm not gonna be, you know, chatting it up or nothing like that. And I mean, I'll probably have a voiceover telling y'all about it, and then, you know, the rest is history. So let's go ahead and get started. This outfit is really bomb, you guys. And thumbs up for that transition, because y'all already know, like, <laughs> but, anyways. Styling ones with baggy jeans, that's like the first thing that I definitely recommend. I have so many baggy jeans that I can style ones with, but this one's pretty simple. I just have this sweater from Pretty Little Thing. Of course, the jeans are as well. Yeah, I know I got my shoes and yeah, it's real cute. It's real cute and chill. I like this fit a lot.
yeah i know we got another transition that's that but anyways this fit is so cute you guys orange and black with this jacket so the sweatshirt is yes style the pants are fashion nova and the jacket is shein so y'all already know i've been waiting to style this jacket and this is the perfect way with these shadow backboard ones y'all it is a look like completely Now, I know y'all didn't expect that transition. I know y'all didn't. But um, anyways, this fit is really cute. And I've been wanting to play with these stack pants for the longest. And I play with them a lot, not gonna lie. But I want to play with them more. So, like I said, everything's from Fashion Nova, except the purse. That's um, Shein. Y'all already know where the shoes is from. But um, this is cute. This is cute. I'm slowly beginning to realize that I actually need to talk about the outfits and not just say if they're cute or not. But with Jordan 1s, you can really just style them with anything, you guys. Like, you can make a girly fit, you can make a chill fit. There's so many different ways you can do it. And, like, you're not limited to the stuff I'm showing in here, like, at all. So, yeah, this is this one. Um, wow. So, top and bottom is pretty little thing. Goodness, I'm on a trend. And the purse is from Shein. Wow. Wow. Okay, yeah. But you guys can kind of see how it's going. So this is the next fit. I actually really like this fit. Now the top is from TL. What? The top is from TLC. The top is a TLC top and it's from Ross. And of course the cargo pants, which I've been wearing a lot lately because I love them, but they're from Zaffle. And of course I just love this fit. A really, really good tip that I like to give you guys is matching your shoes with your top or your accessory. I think it really makes a fit. So try it. Don't try it. I don't know. So this is our last fit. I honestly think this is a really cute and girly fit. I love it so much. Can we bring back wearing skinnies more? Like, I feel like less people wear them now. It's all about boyfriend jeans, which I love. But skinnies, can we bring them back? But yeah, the top is Shein. The bottoms are Fashion Nova. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> but that's in this video. If you did enjoy, definitely give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.